All right, guys, welcome back to the next video on the channel. And today, what we're going to be going over is a new data mine ticket that is coming to Pokemon Go with the ups and downs of this ticket. Like, it's all potential, obviously, we don't know when this is coming or if this is going to happen, but we are going to look at it as well. So, right here is a coin ticket which is coming out between the 16th and 30th of May. Basically giving you 20 coins per day in your special, uh, sorry not special, field research tasks when you have a free space. And then once you complete the task you'll be able to get 20 free coins. Now I say free coins, it does say here you must purchase, uh, hold on where is it? Somewhere on here it says you need to purchase. Now there you go, field research start opens, blah blah blah, this will order you a free ticket. Um, for 300 pro coins, there's no indication how much this ticket is going to be. Um, so, as it says here, 300 pro coins is only three dollars or three pounds based on where you are. If this ticket is more than a pound, ignore it, don't do it. If it was free, it would be so good, it would get so many people coming back to the game because they're introducing new ways of bringing coins and making sure people can get bag space, things like that. However, it doesn't seem like it's going to be free, which is a real shame. However, if they did make this free, I do think there's a potential that they would add a new system into the game that would be free coins and paid coins, meaning that paid you can buy anything you want, do whatever you want. However, the free one might be limited to just normal remote, uh, normal raid passes um, rather than remotes. Um, you can't buy story space, things like that where... It would just limit your gameplay, but you get them for free. I do feel like that is coming, especially with the fact that they've moved the Pokecoins to the top of the shop, meaning that they are running out of money, and they're not getting as much spent as possible. Um, two, two. if this does happen, I feel like Pokemon Go is just going to take a dive. Especially if it is the free ones versus the paid ones. The free ones are never going to get used the way they should do. It's not like a normal gotcha game where you can go and summon a character, you can go and summon um, a weapon, things like that. This is literally just going out, catch Pokemon, and then using raid passes. So the free ones, it it all depends if this system does come in. But I feel like if they do, it's just going to be the end. There's that many things going wrong with Pokemon Go at the minute. I can just see it ending very soon. And I hate to say that because I love this game and obviously love making content on this game. So the longer it lasts, the better. However... We are running out of Pokemon to bring out. We are running out of um, things to do on the game. So I and they keep having to reimagine the things that are there already, rather than making new features as well as reimagining them. So I do think that we are on a downward spiral, and most games do don't usually last this long anyway, especially gotchas and things like that in in the mobile space. So I definitely see a massive decline in Pokemon Go in the near future. I'd say. In the next two years, I can see it being a dead game. So let me know what your thoughts are down below. Um, comment if you think this paid slash free coins will come into play at some point. And also subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I'll speak to you all in the next one.